Hello, class. Good evening. Hello, Daniel. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello. How are you? Hey, nice to see you again. Nice to see you. Yeah, it's been a while. Hi, Christina. How's everything? Marlene, you're there. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, how's it going? I'm doing good. Hello. Thanks for asking. Hey, so it's nice to see you. It's been a while that we haven't been, what? <laughs> receiving classes but it's nice to see you guys again ray welcome ray uh and narciso i can see okay so how was the vacation it's been like oh, three I weeks or, or how many days like today is august 19 which means that is yeah like almost three weeks because each week has seven days right so what do you do on vacations Marlene, tra traveling, mm -hmm. traveling from one country <laughs> to another. <laughs> no, no, todavía. No, no, no yet. And Daniel? Uh, mm -hmm. Traveling to my workplace. <laughs> okay, so from work to your home and vice versa. <laughs> yes. Only only travel to San Miguel. <laughs> travel to San Miguel, Okay. All right, but you know it's it's something. <laughs> okay, so it's nice to see you. And Harrison, how's it going, Harrison? Are you at home? No, I'm teacher at work. At work, okay. It's okay. I can see we have Judy Lisette. How's it going, Judy? Hi, teacher. Hey, I don't see you. <laughs> I think my, my camera or, or something is wrong because hey. I don't see you. <laughs> Uh, teacher, yeah. I am finished a partial. Oh, you're doing a midterm from that university. Oh, yes. okay. <laughs> finish it. I'll, mm -hmm. I'll finish the the in the camera. Okay, so you can say once I finish, I turn on the camera. That's what you can say. Okay, like okay. una vez termine, once I finished, I turn my camera on. You can say that. Well, guys, yeah, it's for me, for me, it's a pleasure to be here. You know, it, this is just a great time that we have. And I'm really uh, positive that we can learn from each other. So I can see that we are as of now 11. JC is arriving. How's it going, JC? Ready for today's We're session? Here. So how was vacation, JC? I'm good, teacher. I, yeah. <laughs> I have a, <laughs> I have a lot of work. No vacation. <laughs> no vacation. Okay. I imagine, you know, but at least there were no classes. <laughs> yeah. And you know, that's a way to, I don't know if you guys kept learning so that's my next question what do you guys do to keep learning you know english did you practice yourself making list of new vocabulary i don't know maybe listening to good music or watching your favorite uh, movies or how did you practice your english within this 19 Good days. Good evening. Welcome. So what do you guys, you know, do? More or less, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? I mean, what did you learn? <laughs> what did you in, learn? In, in, in my case, teacher, I talking with American people. <laughs> yeah, that's really good, you know, if you practice your English with these people, they are the native one, <laughs> right? So what do you guys do? What else do you do? Maria, who, Maria Idalia, Maria Idalia, Elsie, uh, Marlene, Cristina, Maria Julia is here as well. Norma, what do you do to keep practicing your English on vacation? Christina, uh -huh. what did you learn? Uh, tell us. What... Listen to music, teacher. Okay, which ones? Banda, banda, it's Spanish, it's come on. It's <laughs> a lot of. Botella, tra botella, no, that's Spanish. You know? 
that's <laughs> that's not english come on okay so it's okay to you know uh, listen to music but also it would be nice if you can write down your ideas right make a list of vocabulary that you are learning and that would help okay i can see rafa is just arriving so guys welcome i'm going to start today's session by checking the attendance okay so whenever you listen to your name say present or you can say i am here which is totally okay so let me go ahead and check the attendance right now let me open the file really quick the first one on the list this time is narciso Present teacher. Thank you so much, Narciso. Cristina, next one. Present. Thank you. Then we have Daniel. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Next one uh, is Elsie Guadalupe. Elsie? No? All right. Gabriela Guadalupe. Harrison Manuel. Present teacher. Thank you, Harrison. Next one is uh, Jose Miguel. Okay, next one, Jose Rubén. No, okay. JC. Present teacher. Thank you, Linda. No, okay. And Maria Idalia. Present. How are you, Maria Idalia? I'm fine. Nice to hear that. I'm doing good too. <laughs> okay, Maria Idalia is here. Maria Julia. Present teacher. Thank you, Maria Julia. Marlene. Present. Thank you so much. We have Marvin. Marvin, are you here? Not yet. Okay. Next one, Norma Carolina. Norma is here, but I don't listen Present to her. Teacher. Okay, she's there. Rafa. Present teacher. Are you in your corner? <laughs> always, always. <laughs> okay, corner. nice, nice. Okay, good. Okay, I'm glad. I'm glad to see that you are there. Okay, so Rafa is here. Raquel, Judith, Raquel, Elsie, Elsie, you are, Elsie, can you listen to me? I see that you are connected, but I don't, I don't listen to you, Elsie, and I don't see, yeah. okay, yeah, you're there, because I already said your name, but you didn't say anything, and I mark absent here, so, okay, I just made a correction, all right, let's keep going, let's see, then it was Rafa, and then, Raquel Judith. Raquel. Hello, Raquel. Raquel is there, but I think she left. I mean, she's there. Something's wrong. Okay, and then uh, Ray. Ray is here. He, he here, teacher. Where did you go on vacation, Ray? Did you travel? Uh, only near it's the uh, Ruta La Flores, yes. That's nice. it. Good. Did you, did you go to the labyrinth? No. Yeah? Okay. Did you ring the bell? <laughs> yes? Okay. Yeah. It's, an, it's a nice exercise. Xiomara del Carmen. Is Xiomara here? Not right. She not, she's not here. I don't see her. Okay. Judy Lisette. Judy? Presente, teacher. Thank you, Judy. Next one, and then we finish. Okay, great. Okay, I'm gonna start uh, first activity with, uh, this is an activity that we all know, but I think it's important that we guys, that we, I mean, that we go ahead and check this out because these are the instructions that we have to check. Marvin is arriving. Hello, Marvin. Marvin? Hello. Okay, um, so can you guys see my screen? Can you see what I'm sharing? Yes or not? Yes. 
Okay, beautiful. Give me a second. It's just loading on my end. Let's see. I think it's going think to... It's okay, we're ready. I think somebody has the mic open. Alguien tiene el micrófono encendido me hace eco. Marvin? Okay, let me, let me... Okay. Okay. Let me see. Yes, that's fine. You can open your mic, of course, guys, but if you are not participating, I will appreciate it if you can just you know, turn it off. Okay. So this is, so welcome. This is course uh, number four. And um, my name, for those who don't know me yet, uh, my full name, you can see it on the screen, but I like to be called Armando. That's my uh, my favorite name if I have to choose one, okay? So we start our class. This is a little bit about me. You know, I'm very, let's say, committed to um, teaching and I love doing it. So whenever you have questions and, and if I can help you, you know, I'll, I'm available for that. That's one thing. Second thing is that in this environment, we are all, you know, allowed to make mistakes, okay? So that means that we can, ask each other questions we can you can you guys can participate and i can of course help you guys out if you if you have um anything to suggest or any comments for me it'll be great okay so i'm a person who uh, loves you know uh feedback so if you have any suggestion or any recommendation guys i'm well i'm you know i'm gonna be open to that okay so uh, some, of, some of the uh, requirements that we have, uh, this is in Spanish. We're gonna read it in Spanish, okay? I know that you guys know this, however, we need to go over. So I need a volunteer to read all of these requirements. So who would like to volunteer to read these requirements? Anybody? Hey, teacher. Thank you so much, appreciate that. Okay. Requerimientos, el nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. En el caso de oyentes, agregar palabra oyente y luego su nombre. Cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. Minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible y participación activa. All right, I really appreciate that. Any questions, guys, on this? No questions. So remember that if you, uh, once you connect, it has to be your full name, right? As you see it on your ID, okay? Like uh, first, second name, and then last names, the two last names. So that's mandatory, okay? And then the camera always on, okay? If you have issues with your camera, please let us know so we know that you have problems but do not have this as an, ex as an excuse, okay? So you, you want to let us know because it's mandatory for you to have the camera all the time on. And then of course that I will really appreciate if you participate, okay? So if you have questions, go ahead and say, hey, I have a question. I don't have this clear and it's my objective and it's my responsibility to explain and investigate with you if necessary, okay? So that's something that we have to keep in mind. Please participate as much as possible. And of course, this is two hours class. It is the, the time for you to practice your English. That is something that I wanted to say that please let's try to like keep this class like an English environment. Try to avoid using Spanish as much as possible, okay? If you want to participate, just go ahead and, and you know, participate. And do not uh, be afraid to make mistakes because mistakes are part of the learning process, okay? So do not be afraid to make like mistakes on, on this, participate participate, practice. That's, that's something that we have to be doing in all classes, okay? And I need another volunteer for this part. Maybe one boy this time, please, because we already had a girl. Me, teacher. Thank you so much, please. Asistencia al 100% de las clases. La asistencia no solamente se toma al estar presente, sino también al cumplir la clase completa. La asistencia se toma en tres ocasiones. 8, 9 y 9.55 pm. 
se tomará como válida al escuchar al participante decir presente o present y tener la cámara encendida. Sesiones uno a uno disponibles. Cada participante será asignado 10 minutos al finalizar cada clase para aclarar dudas con su facilitador. Permisos no disponibles. Ok, you see, no permissions available. Ok, so this is something that we know already. Guys, we check the attendance three times, right? And then uh, for you to be ready. And try to be on time. Do not, you know, join us late unless you have, you know, any type of uh, maybe emergencies or maybe at work you have you have to stay late and then that affect but then you try to avoid um, joining to the class late be punctual be on time that's something that you have to consider all, at all times and then um one on one okay i shared already the um, the list of uh, the schedule i'm including the one-on-one -on -one sessions We start today with Narciso. I think it's number one on the list. So Narciso, today is your time. We're gonna have the chance to, you know, uh, practice. And if you have any questions, you can just simply go ahead and ask, okay? So please track on that, check the list and see when is your day and be ready for, you know, to participate and ask questions, okay, on this date. And well, let's see, let's keep going. Do you have any questions or any comments before we move on with this part? Any questions? No? Okay, so let's um, then read the next uh, slide. Anybody who would like to help? Maybe one girl this time. Who wants to help us out reading this? Elsie, thank you, Elsie. Hello. Ah. Uh -huh. Tareas y evaluaciones. Es necesario obtener el 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente. Las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. Todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completos antes de cada viernes a medianoche ya que este registro es enviado a Insafor semanalmente. La fecha límite para terminar el examen medio mid, mid, mid term, no sé, uh -huh, es, mid el, es el miércoles 1 de septiembre antes de la medianoche. La fecha límite para terminar el examen final es el jueves 16 de septiembre antes de la medianoche. El manual puede ser descargado en la plataforma. No se utiliza material de terceros en ninguna sesión. Okay. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Yes, in this uh, specific occasion, since we are starting the class on Thursday, we are not starting on Monday. So our midterm is going to be on Wednesday, September 1st, okay? But my strong recommendation is this, do not leave homework assignment by the end of the week. If you can do it, let's say today we finish classes, you can do it once we finish classes. Okay, so you don't accumulate the homework and that's going to be uh, what? It's gonna take long and then you're gonna be a little bit stressed out and that's going to affect. So I, I suggest doing every homework every day, one at a time. That's easier and that's better, okay? And then we're gonna have our final exam on uh, September 16. So I'm expecting at this point, everybody is, you know, able to pass, to, you know, do well on the test, okay? So um, we do not use any other material from any, we cannot uh, use material like music or, I mean, songs or any, material from other uh, resources due to copyrights. You know, that's something that we don't do it and we all know this. However, we have the uh, manual. We have the, we have this in PDF or if you would like to print it, you can print it. You can have it ready for each class. I always suggest doing this because if you have it physically, that's better and easier because sometimes being in front of the, front of the screen, that might affect, right? It's not the same. It's not the same experience. Okay. 
Um, any questions? Any questions before we move on? Any questions, comments? Clear on this? Yes? Okay. Uh, look at this part. This is my favorite one because I want you to please use all these uh, features that we have on this wonderful tool, Zoom. If you want to ask for help, if you want to participate, you can raise your hand, okay? You can raise your hand. You can uh, use the silent button here. So you make sure you're not distracting or you, there's no background noise. Cameras on all the time. Chatting, it's something that we are gonna be using a lot. And of course, if we, we are gonna practice sometimes in rooms, like breakout rooms. Okay. Uh, and you can, of course, use reactions. We have reactions. We have, um, what else do we have here? Uh, we have the board. Sometimes we're going to use it. We have the annotate you know, feature. We can use it. And you sometimes can share your screen, which is also nice. Do you have any additional question before we move on? No, no, quest sure. no questions, no answers. All right, so that's really cool. We finished this activity, I mean, this introduction. And now let me go back. Um, let's see. We are 18 uh, connected now, which is nice. And Linda is here. Linda is here. Norma Carolina, I can see her now. I don't see Raquel. I see something dark. <laughs> I don't see her. And then Marvin is here. And Xiomara. Xiomara is here as well. So that's cool. Now, um, since I see some new faces here, maybe I see Elsie. I also see Maria Idalia. Judy, I haven't seen her yet, but she's new. Uh, and then who else is new in this group? Raquel, I think. So we're gonna do an activity, really quick one, because I want you to um, tell us a little bit about you, okay? Uh, this activity is very simple. However, you can add more details, more information, okay, about you. But before we do that, let me share the screen. Hold on, let me try. Here we go. Let's see. Let me share it. Okay, I think I think you guys can see it. But let me make it bigger. It says getting to know each other a little bit more, okay? I'm, tr I'm trying to make this bigger, but it won't let me do it. So it's okay. Let's see, what do you see on the screen? There's um, what, like an image here, which says, my name is, and then it says, if I were an animal, I'll be, and you say the name of the animal, and you, then you mention why, okay? So I'm gonna give you some time because I want you to think about it. And if you have access to, to the internet, please go ahead and look for the image of the, um, I mean, the one that you're gonna choose and then you can share it, okay? Either on the chat or maybe you can a screen share and that'll be okay. So um, think about this. You wanna say your name and then think about the animal you, want, you would like to be and, the, and then say why, okay? So take if I think is, let's see, 824. So I'm gonna give you uh, three minutes for you to think about it. Start thinking guys, and then you're gonna share. Whenever you have your answer ready and you're ready, please let me know. Maybe you already have one. Maybe.
Let's take one more minute. Yes, tell me, Dalia. Okay, um, if I were an animal, I'd, I'd be an ant because uh, they know how to work on a team. On a team. Nice, That's, that is a good one. And um, I love that answer. I like it. Okay, now, uh, so complete the, the, the structure. Say your name. And oh. like, like this, <laughs> my name is Armando and I like to be called by, by my second name. And you can add more, more ideas. Right there, you can mm -hmm. add more ideas. The purpose is that you... Um, we know now that you like teamwork, okay, because of what you said. But then if you can have more information about you, and if you can share it, that'll be great, okay? So take your time, go ahead, start again. Okay. Yes, go ahead. Hello? Can you try once again, please? Okay. Um, my name is Maria Idalia Hernandez de Palacios. I'm married. I'm uh, 28 years old. I, um, I work at Mirador Plaza Hotel and um, I don't know, um, and I complete with the, the with the practice. Um, and uh, if I were on an animal, I'd be an ant because they know how to work on a team. Yep, just that. Nice. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, okay? And thank you for sharing a little bit about you. That's cool, okay? And I like your answer about animals. I hadn't thought about that, <laughs> but it's a good one. <laughs> good. Anybody else? Uh, maybe, Idalia, you want to choose the next person, please. Mm, Daniel Antonio Luna. Okay. Price selection. Hello, uh, my name is Daniel Luna. You can call me Daniel. Uh, I have 48 years old. I work uh, in a Air Force base near to Air International Airport. In and if we are an animal, I will be a wolf because uh, I protect to my family. Nice. Did you say wolf? Yes, wolf. Yes. Can, yeah. I, can, I, can I share an image? Yeah, that's exactly what I asked you to do it. Go ahead. I imagine the twilight. Is it wolf? I don't remember. Go ahead. Uh, I need I need uh, I need you to stop to share to share your screen picture. Thank you. Go ahead. Let me this. <laughs> okay. Yeah, uh, I like the, it. The, the, this is the I'll say. <laughs> ¿Cómo lo puedo decir en, en no sé? Bueno, la loba que está en la parte de abajo de la, del lobo está como, como asustada. Pero el mensaje es que le está protegiendo la garganta al lobo para enfrentar al lobo grande. Entonces el amor es proteger. Es, nice. Eso es, es, es en, la, 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 en lo que me, me gusta compartir de eso. Lovely. Daniel, <laughs> I know you can say that in English. I know uh, you can try. Ok. Uh, uh, I'll say, I'll say Loa, Loa. <laughs> female wolf? Yeah, yeah, female I think, wolf. Yeah, uh -huh. I think, the, yeah. The, the female wolf is protect the, the protect 
your body of the world only <laughs> he 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 looks he looks scary he looks mm -hmm. scary but he protects the protect the the, the body of the world mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. so that means that loving is protecting people you love okay until you die <laughs> okay i like the image thank you so much okay thank you daniel you can choose the next person let me see marlene nicole hello okay hello my name is marlene i work in a jewelry and i don't know my favorite color is green and my favorite food is mexican food then um, if I were an animal, he's a um, hawk, and I would like to be a hawk because um, I could fly anywhere and visit many places, I think. <laughs> Only that. Okay, so you are like a person who loves traveling from one place to another. That's why the hug yes. is the best one. Okay, <laughs> I like it. You feel identified with this animal. Okay, good. Yeah. Good answer. Thank you so much, Marlene. Next person, you choose it, please. Um, Christina. Hello. My name is Cristina Martinez. I have 30 years old. My favorite food is pizza. Uh, my color, my favorite color is white. I I if were an animal is bed eye angle because they fly high and are the only bird that when they get or they have the possibility of re rejuvenate. Rejuvenate. Reju 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 so that's the ego, right? Ego. Mm -hmm. Okay. Only that. Okay, Christina, I don't know, but I hear you a little bit down. Like, I don't know. Are you feeling sick? No? Tired? It's Thursday. <laughs> Maybe that. But thank you so much for sharing. Uh, next person, Christina, choose it, please. Uh, don't care. Uh, Raquel? Hello, good evening. My name is Raquel. Uh, my last name is De Cordoba. I live in Soyapango. Uh, I am 32 years old. And if we're an animal, it'd be a cat because they are quiet and loving. You think so? <laughs> okay, but they are aggressive sometimes. But uh, I'm glad, I'm glad you see it that way. So I'll be, you'll be a cat. Okay, nice. I'll be a cat. Good, thank you so much for sharing. Okay, next person, volunteers. I know everybody wants to do it, but we don't have much time left. So volunteers. Volunteers, guys? No volunteers. Okay, Hola. Rachel. Oh, thank you so much, Judy. Go ahead. Uh, my name is Judy Hernandez. I live in Santa Ana. Uh, I work in American Park, Fruit of the Loom. Our year 
I am year 29. I am 29 year old. Sí, ¿verdad? Eh, ¿Cuál era la otra pregunta? Ya no me acuerdo. <laughs> ok, think about an animal. Ok. Uh, I... A dolphin. 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 Okay. If I were an animal, I'll uh, be a dolphin. I, uh, I am afraid of the sea, and they buy natural light. Like there, my biggest fear is darned by drone, drone, drone. No sé si lo dije. Um, es como yo admiro más que todo ese animal. Porque ellos son de, del agua, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Y mi mayor miedo o fobia quizás es... Ah, I got it. Okay. Eh, ajá, okay. okay, got it. Uh, like when you... Um, let's say if you my If you cannot swim, you can drown, right? And that, okay. I, yes. I get it. Okay, I get it. Okay. Thank you so much for sharing. Uh, anything else, Judy, that you want to add? What? Anything else that you would like to add? Anything else that you would like to add? Do you understand uh, that? Finish. Okay, thank you so much. Next person. Next one. Me, teacher. Thank you, Norma. Okay. My name is Norma Carolina Villeda. I live in Tonacatepec. I work in Central Mercantilista. I like to see movies, different types, for example, horror and comedy movies and all Mexican movies too. And if we're an animal, I'd be a tiger because it's a fast and strong and secretive, uh, sigiloso teacher, no sé si es correcto, secretive. Yeah. Um, and besides have a beautiful colors. Mm, like it has beautiful yeah. colors. Yeah, yeah, I agree with that. So it's the yeah. fastest yeah. animal. Yes. Okay, good. Thank you. And I think the fastest animal on land, uh, right? I, I don't know if it's the tiger or the cheetah. I think it's the cheetah, but they're very like... Uh, the lions. The lions. Okay, uh -huh. I didn't know that. But thank you so much for sharing. Anybody else? Or maybe Norma can choose this. Choose, it and choose the next person. Okay, Norma, choose the next person, please. Narciso. Good evening. Uh, my name is Angel. The last, the last name is Cardona. I live in Guayua. Uh, my favorite color is uh, yellow. Uh, uh, I'll be an animal, uh, uh, Leo. Uh, I like to know the jungle. Like, that's all. Okay, so that would be the lion, right? Yes? I'll see so? Yes. Is that yes. Okay. Yes. You you like the jungle, you say. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. Thank you so much. Guys, I want to listen to everybody, but I don't know who wants to go next because I know you have great ideas to share and I would love to listen to all of you. So who wants to go fair? Who wants to go next? Next? Anybody who has insured? <laughs> Only observing, JC is like he doesn't want to say anything. And Ray getting comfortable on his sofa. And, okay, and then who haven't shared? And Harrison and just just laughing and don't want to. Hey, teacher, okay. Uh -huh. Let me see. My name is Harrison Hernandez. I am a, an industrial engineer. I work in Sigma Coop, Photoflex, and I live in Ciudad Lugado. Um, um, if you were an animal, I'd be an angel too, like Christina, because I would like to have that freedom and look from the sky. 
So I'd like to be a nigga to have the freedom and look back or look down from the sky. Okay. Sounds yeah. like cool, right? Sounds really cool. All right. Then thank you so much, guys. I don't know if there is anybody else who still would like to share. Okay. So no problem. Then we're going to move on. We're going to... Um, well, Rafa Taylor, Rafa. Rafa is being quiet. I don't know why. And Rafa, then... Rafa, we have to marry. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Good evening, everyone. Again, my name is Rafael Sandoval. I like your English music and room in the morning. I am very... Six years old. I live in Japan City. And if I were an animal, I'd be a lion because the lions are strong. And you are strong. <laughs> strong. <laughs> okay. Very strong. Okay. You love running. I know yeah. that. So Thank you so much for sharing. And then we're going to have other activities maybe throughout the week so you guys can also share about you because we need to go back to the class, let's say, and we can start the topic, okay? Maybe you have already checked the first uh, unit and I would like to know what, it, what do you know about it? What is the name of it? And what, uh, let's see, vocabulary that you have read or you have learned. I don't know, I think the manual was shared, I don't know if today or previously, but then anybody, please open your mic and tell me what's the unit's name. Number one, unit number one. What is it? Linda, what's the unit's name? No, JC? We have Mary Julie, <laughs> Mary Dahlia. What is the unit's name for this class? Purchasing and storing. Exactly, purchasing and storing, okay, great. I want to know what a feature is. So what is a feature, Daniel? What's a feature? Do you remember from a previous course what we said a feature is? Uh, Mm, okay, purchasing uh, is how, how can I buy the, the stuff we can use in the office. Okay, mm -hmm. yes. And what is a feature? What is it? What did we say in previous uh, classes or, or what did we study or what did you study on previous classes about this? Uh, when we say feature, what is it? Or what would be a synonym of a feature? Feature uh, is, is, is the, no, I don't, I don't, <laughs> I don't, don't know. Mm -hmm. no, it's I don't okay. Know. Who remembers what a feature is? What is feature. Look at the unit's name. As you said, it is purchasing and storing, right? And on this unit, we're going to learn to describe different features. This is the word I'm talking about. What are features? Anybody who can tell me what a feature is or any synonym of this word? Okay, I heard it, I heard it is uh, characteristics, right? That is a synonym. Or what else can we say about it? Those things that make something different or like attributes, those are features, right? And our first activity is um, we have a matching activity. Let's see, we have right here. Let me scroll a little bit. A second, I scroll up, okay. We have um, eight features here. So features, as you said, I think it was Harrison, I don't know who said it, are those uh, things or characteristics that make something different, okay? And we have eight here. So number one is, how do we pronounce this one? 
Idalia, how do we pronounce the first one? Pronunciation, how do we say it? Do you know? Size. Size, very good. What about number two? What do we say, anybody? Wait. Wait, good, Wait. thank you. How about number three? What do we say? Price. Price, very good, price. How about number four? Dimension. Dimension. Dimensions, okay, dimensions. How about number five? Battery life. life. Yeah, battery life. battery life. We can say battery. It sounds this this one sounds better if we say R, yeah. like one R. Battery, battery life, yeah. battery life. Okay, battery life. And how about number six? What do we say here? Storage. Storage. <laughs> Storage. storage, storage, good, H, storage, H, H. Oh, what H. about number seven? What do we say here? Function, Function. Function. good. Function. And number eight, we say? Warranty. Warranty, Warranty. yes, exactly. Yeah. So our first activity, guys, as you, you already said it, is about purchasing, storing, and these are some of the things that we are going to start doing today. I want you to start matching. Let's find the answers. What is the, let's say, the best option for size? Is it A, B, C, D, and, and so on? What is it? Okay, let's go over these uh, statements here. Let's see, Rafa, read letter A, please. Only read. As of now, only read. I don't see, I don't hear you, because I think your mic is off. Mm -hmm. Okay, measurement uh, proportion mm -hmm. of some kind. Okay, measure, 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 measurement, measure, measure. This is like uh, the verb is measure. That's the verb, that's the action. And the noun is measurements, measurements. Good. Measurement. Exactly. Thank you so much. Next one, let's see. Um, Norma, read number, letter B, please. Letter B. Uh, prom promit to repair, replace something, leaving a period of time. Period of time. Good. So promise, a promise to repair. Promise. Promise, yes, the promise mm -hmm. is the noun, like, like the politicians. <laughs> they promise, but they never, you know, comply. <laughs> so uh, when you want to convince or you are flirting with somebody, especially boys, they start promising the moon and the stars, but they never do anything when they got it or when, when <laughs> they get it. Okay, so promise, good. You promise something? If you promise, you have to comply with it, okay? So promise, promise, promise. Good. Letter C. Let's see, uh, Maria, Idalia, please. Letter C. Okay. Uh, a measure of battery, performance, and longevity. Thank you so much. A measure of battery, performance, and longevity. Good. Number, number, letter D. Let's see, Marlene, I haven't heard you. So, Marlene, go ahead. I think overall dimension or magnitude. Nice, thank you, good pronunciation. Let's see, next one, I haven't heard you. Ray, go ahead, please. The space. Letter D. E, as in elephant. E, e space, a value for retention of something. Okay, the space available, space. available, 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 available. Yes, thank you so much. Next one, let's see who I haven't heard. Let's see. Um, hmm. Who's connecting me? Marvin? I don't know. Yeah, Marvin, are you connecting? I think I, I saw him. Marvin? Hello? Yes, Hello? go ahead. Uh, uh, body is relative mass or the quantity contained by somebody. Thank you so much. Is the quantity contained? Remember the pronunciation of the ed contained, contained by mm. something. Good. 
Let's move on. We have letter G for Narciso and letter H for Daniel. Go ahead, guys, please. The amount of money recorded or, or paid for something. Thank you. Paid, required, required, require. The amount of money required, required or paid for something. Good. So right next to the word required. So you don't you don't uh, forget you know how to pronounce this. Next one, Daniel. Practical use for purpose in design. Awesome. So let's take five minutes and start matching, please, these teachers with their definitions. When you finish, let me know, please. Okay, let's take one more minute. Let's see, I think somebody finished and that's Daniel. Thank you so much for confirming. Okay, let's take a couple of seconds more and then we're gonna start sharing, okay? Ray, finished? Finished, yeah. Nice, and Rafa? Finished. Nice, three. Marlene, Marvin, Harrison, JC, Idalia, finished. Cristina, oh, yeah. Lydia. Oh, yeah. All right, take one more minute then. Okay, thank you, Narciso, for confirming.
Raquel finish, Judy finish. <laughs> Linda, do you finish? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you. And Raquel, don't cover the camera. I saw you, huh, Raquel. And Judy, did you finish? Yes? Yes, you finished. Finish. Thank you, JC. Okay, I don't know if uh, you guys can listen to me. I don't know if you if Yuri can listen to me. But anyways, uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, let's see what time is it. It's uh, three to seven, three to nine. Okay, so um, let's share the answers. But then, uh, as it says here, we are going to check the answers with a partner. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna compare the answers. So this is what we're what we're gonna do. I'm gonna check the attendance, and then we're going to share. You know the the um, the answers with somebody to see if we have the same and we are going to add another activity which is um answering some questions which are just below this activity okay let me go ahead and uh, check the attendance i know it's not uh, it's like two minutes to to nine but it's fine i can just go ahead and update this right now let's see number one on the list narciso present teacher thank you so much narciso uh next one christina Present. Thank you, Cristina. Daniel. Present teacher. Thank you, Elsie Guadalupe. Elsie. Here, here. Thank you, Elsie. Gabriela Guadalupe. No. Okay. Herson. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Jose Miguel. No. Okay. Uh, Jose Ruben. No connected. JC. Yes. Present teacher. Thank you so much, JC. Next one, Linda. Present teacher. Thank you. Next one here is uh, Maria Julia. Maria Julia. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Marlene. Present. Thank you, Marlene. Next one, Marvin. Yeah, I saw Marvin connected. Marvin. Thank you so much, Marvin. Next one in here, uh, Norma. Present teacher. Thank you, Norma. Rafa. Present teacher. Thank you, Raquel Judith. Present. Thank you, Ray. Present teacher. Thank you, Xiomara. Nice Present Xiomara. teacher. Thank you. And last but not least, Judy Lisette. Judy? Oh. Excuse me, teacher. You didn't say your name. Didn't I mention your name, Idalia? Yeah. Yeah. You didn't. I think. Let me see what happened. Yeah, but I marked pressing. Something went wrong. So thank you so much for letting me know. Okay. I just uh, double check, but and it is already marked. So thank you. But anyway, that was good on your end to let me know. Let's see. This is what we're gonna do now. We are going to work in pairs, guys. First thing that you guys are gonna do is that you're going to check if you have the same uh, answers, right? Check on the features and see if you guys have the same answers and the correct, uh, let's say, the definitions of each feature. But then I also want you to take advantage of the time and work on these questions, okay, in pairs. We have three questions, and this is gonna be about your companies, okay? Question number one is, how many products does your workplace buy and which ones are they? Okay, so think about those products in general uh, that your company buys. And then we have number two, approximately how many units do they buy of it? If you know, if you don't know, you can improvise it or invent it, okay? The purpose is to practice, okay? Number three, how much money do you think they spent? Okay, maybe you don't know exactly the amount, but then you can maybe try to guess, okay? So activity number one, we check on matching activity, if it's okay, if you have the same. Number two, you answer these questions, okay? You ask each other, you answer, and then you, you guys come back and we start socializing the questions and answers, and also the answers from the first activity, okay? So do you have questions or anything uh, in regards of this um, activity? 
No? Okay, so here we go. We're gonna create the um, groups, I mean the pairs right now, and start working on this. So we are 18, I think it just maybe, let me see, 18, so that'll be uh, eight groups. Maybe one or two groups are going to be uh, with three participants, which is also okay. Here we go. pues tenemos que responder las preguntas. ¿Perdón? That is correct. Eh, las preguntas tenemos que responder. Exacto, okay. that is correct. Try to speak English, no Spanish, please. No Spanish. Try to speak English. Ok, Raquel, Elsie. Teacher, eh. Eh, yo no sé mucho inglés y cómo se llama. Y la verdad que no lo entendí porque... No lo entendí muy bien, la verdad, lo que exactamente quiere que hagamos. Yo no sé mucho de inglés. Ah, porque no me preguntan, pues se me deja ahí colgado. Dile, questions, no. <risa> Todos. Questions, questions, y no me dice nada. Tiene que preguntar, si no, yo voy a creer que ya sabe. Y, ok, lo que vamos a hacer es que van a este, responder. Primero van a socializar sus, sus matching activities, si tienen las mismas, ¿verdad? En la, segundo, van a responder su, las preguntas que están. Eh, Raquel le pregunta a usted y usted le pregunta a Raquel. Así. Las preguntas, las tres que están okay. ahí abajo. Vaya, enciende la, enciende la cámara porque yo no la veo. No sé si es la mía que no funciona porque no la veo. <risa> Ahorita la enciendo. Permítame. Vaya, no se duerma. No, no estoy dormida. Estoy... Mire, ya se había dormido. Dios no, no estoy mío. dormida. <risa> Ya no. dormida, estaba ahí como... No. Ay, él sí, la cachamos. No, no, no estaba dormida. Vaya, pues. Vaya, ya estaba escuchando. Vaya, ahí, ahí está, entonces, este, Judith. Este, practiquen. Primero vean si tienen las mismas respuestas. De acuerdo. Okay, Se volvió a ir, mire. No, 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 no. Es que esta cosa... O sea, es que es bien caro estarla viendo a usted. No, aquí estoy. No. no, igual casi ahorita no tengo mucha conexión, porque de hecho cuando eh, me conecté, bueno, me iba a conectar, me costó un montón. Y de ahí, no sé, cuando estaba comenzando a pasar lista, que me sacó automáticamente, entonces no sé. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ok, bueno, entonces practique con su compañera. ¿Ustedes se conocen desde el grupo anterior? No. 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 Yo creí que era. Bueno, excelente. Anyways, practice. Y no sé qué de la duda. Si usted no entiende, diga si la verdad el propósito es que se entienda. Ok. Es que usted habla solo en inglés. No, module 4. Estamos en el module 4, así que vaya acostumbrándose. Estaba en el 2. ¿En serio? Sí. Bueno. Me pasaron para el 4 porque dijeron que no había cupo en, los, en el 3, supuestamente. Entonces, por eso fue que, y fue como que, o sea, ah. entiendo que estamos ya en el nivel 4, pero ajá. Vale, sí, le comprendo. Yo le voy a ayudar, uh -huh. pero quiero que se comunique bien para que le, le sepamos ayudar, ¿ok? No, okay. Tenga, no tenga pena ni tenga miedo que todos estamos aprendiendo, todos pasamos por eso. Así que, relax. Bueno, ahí eh, le dejo, pa. Vale. Vale, chido, pues. How is this group doing? Ready to share? Mm, yes, teacher. Both activities? 
matching and questions and answers? Yes, we have all we have uh, all the all the all the answers cor uh, okay. mm -hmm. uh, cor correctly. Okay. Yes, we we have all the all the all the the eight the eight match is okay, and we are working in the number three. How many rows mm -hmm. does your work? Perfect. In this in, in this question, uh, teacher, uh, I I say my workplace by computer. Is 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 correct the answer? Yeah, my workplace buys computers. Yes, that's a product. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, this yes. is the product. Okay. Okay, this, this which, is the product. Which one, ones are gay? Is escoger uno de ellos, verdad? Right. Uh, which ones are they? And then you want to say computers because those are the, and maybe you want to specify, for example, um, Dell computers or, um, you know, the brand that they buy. Maybe you want to mention the brand. So you are more specific. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 say uh, a laptop or work or, or this or this computer. I like it, yeah, the type yeah, of computer. Yeah, yeah sounds great. Okay. So you share, and then once you're ready, maybe give me one or two more minutes because I'm checking on the other groups, okay? But then finish and then keep asking okay. questions each other, practicing. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. How's it going, ladies? <laughs> How's it going? Ready to share? Uh, what do you mean at uh, the, the, the first question? At uh, the products uh, I, I sell in my workplace or? No, buy. Like, how many pros does your oh, workplace oh. buy? And, like, uh, ¿cuántos productos compra tu compañía y cuáles son? Uh, what type of products? Uh, I don't know. You guys know. <laughs> okay. Computers, printers, um, like, I don't know, furniture, mobiliario, I don't know what, oh, all the stuff. I, I think, I think it's uh, my, for example, in my, in my workplace, it's like jewelry. I think it's a piece of jewelry. Jewelry. No. Jewelry. Jewelry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Like two more minutes, and then we're gonna go back. So please. Okay. Yeah. Good. Hello. Hello. Are you guys Hi, ready? Teacher. Hi, teacher. <laughs> Ready to share? <laughs> no, you don't listen to me? Yes, teacher, I listen. Hello? Um, hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hi. Oh. I don't listen hello. to you guys. Huh? Hi, teacher. No. I don't know what's going on with this thing. <laughs> okay.
Jenny, and are you at work? Daniel? Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. Yes, sir. yes, yes, teacher, I am I'm here in, in my workplace. This is my second night. Second night, oh, okay. Second, second day of four night. Yeah, I remember you said that. So I imagine it's not easy, right? But then I really admire that because, uh, I mean, working at night and also studying is a challenge, being honest. But the <laughs> challenge is for, you know, uh, I mean, challenges are for people who really want to, you know, uh, what succeed. And that's you, <laughs> Daniel. <laughs> so good. Let's see. Let, first activity, guys. Uh, let me know about. Uh, so, did you guys have the same answers on the first activity? Not nothing different. The same answers. Yes. Or in did my you in my group have the same answer? Answer. Same answers. Okay. Daniel's okay. group. Same answers. Okay. And what about JC's group? Yeah. Hello? Do you guys listen to me, my Puchan? Yes, teacher. Okay, JC's group? Hi, JC. JC. Here, teacher. Norma. The same answers. Okay. Um, let's see, Narciso's group. No differences in on the first activity. No, no different. No different. Okay, okay. So now let's do let's do something. I want you to send me one from the team. Send me your answers on the chat. Okay, and then so we are like sure that we got we all have the same answers. Okay, so for example, you want to start typing letter A is this, letter B is this. Okay. Teacher, uh, uh, Ray and me, uh, we have a doubt. Okay. Size and dimensions. Mm. Which one did, that is a good one. Which one did you choose for uh, dimensions? Which one, which letter? Uh, size, letter D. Mm -hmm. and, and, and 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 Ray is la tiene al revés que yo ah, diga la otra this. dimension letter he él tiene letter he D he has he has and letter D has, ah yeah. okay so let's see the first one dimensions is letter A that's the okay. answer okay so measurements or proportion of some kind, that's the one. Okay. And then size what? is letter D. Yeah, size is okay. like, is size is the overall yeah. dimension or magnitude, that is the size. Because dimensions has to do with measured medidas, right, dimensions. But then the size is the overall, es el todo, that's the size, okay. the overall. So that's, that's um, you know, I don't know if you got, let me send, to make this quicker, let me send the answers, okay? Look at this one. I send it on the chat. Compare, please. Compare if you have the same. Compareness, please, if you have the same. The same one, or is there any mistake? Okay. I'm I only in the num in the in the letter A I have the number one. In the in the letter D I have the number four. But I think oh, okay. Yes. Similar. Similar. Okay. Yes. 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 Okay. Anybody else? Xiomara, what about you? Idalia, what about you? Do you have the same answers? Yeah. Number yeah. A number four. Okay. B number A C 
number five, uh -huh. T number one, T number one, uh -huh. E number six, yeah, F I, I number uh -huh. F number two, F number two, yeah, that's correct. Um, G, G number three, three, yes, that's correct. Yes, that's exactly what uh, I said. H number Seven. Number seven function. Yes, that's correct. Yep. Yes, just a little change on this, right? Dimensions, letter A, which is measurements or proportions of something. Those are the dimensions. And then the size, like uh, Linda said, is the overall, it's el todo, it's, la, it's el tamaño, size, is, okay? Okay, good. So that would be the answer. Now let's make something different with the next activity. I want you to uh, make this sort of like uh, conversation, okay? We have three questions, right? And the questions are talking about products on the company, right? And then um, I want you to interact with your partner as if uh, you are like first like greeting each other. Hey, how, how are you? And so tell me, how many products does your workplace buy? But then I want you to think about an introduction, how you can make this introduction before you ask these questions. So do not just go ahead and ask directly, think about how you can make this naturally, like what else can you add, okay? So let's try to make a conversation out of these questions. And for this, I don't know who uh, would like to go first. We have three questions. But then not only ask the question, but also make it, make it like a, a very uh, short dialogue. Who would like to improvise first? How can we improvise? Hey, Daniel, I heard you worked for a company named blah, blah, blah. Or I don't know. Is it true that you work in a company where you usually buy products? And then you say, I don't know. Maybe, yeah, I do. And then you start asking and whatever comes to your mind. So I want you to try to improvise it. Can you guys try? Make it, you know, sounds not that like, I don't know, scripted. Who wants to go? and try it, who wants to do it? I know you didn't practice this way, I know that, but then that's the challenge. Raise your hand, or do I choose the big teams? You choose the big teams. <laughs> <laughs> come, on, come on come on I, was, I don't like that okay but i can choose to try i mean say hey how's it going is it all good yeah so tell me about your company and i don't know okay. you start talking okay. make okay. it the, the first thing is me go who ahead is the, who is the next <laughs> Yeah, I like it. So it's not going to be within your teams. You want somebody else, okay? JC is willing to participate. Oh, Go ahead. Who is going to talk with me? JC is. Okay, teacher. Okay. It's Daniel. Hello, JC. How are you? I'm fine, Daniel. What about you? Nice. Nice. I, I'm here. I'm, I'm, work, I'm my work at my workplace. Hey. And, hey. and your workplace? Oh. Yes, yes, yes. I see in your Facebook in you work in the in the company who buy who who who's buy you have a you have a you have a you have a work you have a workplace in your workplace uh, what do you product just buy? I'm my in my workplace I buy uh gold nails and varnish varnish. Okay. Okay, wool. Uh, which 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 type of wool you buy? Um one hundred units, more or less. Okay, okay perfect. And how much money the the, the wool? Is, uh, is 
And I think that um, one thousand dollars. One thousand dollars. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. This is for for make for make a furniture. Furniture. Yes. I'm sorry. Uh, the wool is for make a uh, furniture. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Perfect. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna call to you when I need. A furniture of uh, wool. Okay. Okay, yes. Daniel. Okay, Daniel. Okay, Jason. Um... Okay, yes, thank you for the information. You're welcome, Daniel. Okay, teacher. If, if, if I need a, a a newer desk, I'm a coach. Okay. <laughs> Yes, yes. <laughs> okay, great. Nice. Okay, clear. Great. That's exactly what I want to hear. Okay. So that you uh, like try to improvise. I know uh, maybe. Do, do you know the word furniture, JC? Yes. Do you yeah, know this? Teacher. Yes. Okay. Awesome. Then so good. That was really good. So thank you so much. You see, that's what I'm talking about. You guys can do it. So I need two more participants to do it. Maybe this time we're gonna have JC and Daniel choose the next two person. Choose one each, please. Okay. Okay, my choose person is Linda. <laughs> nice. My chosen person. La my persona, chosen person. Uh, mi okay. persona elegida. My chosen person is. <laughs> my chosen person is yes. Linda. Ah, ahorita ya está viéndome, pero no quiere. <laughs> <laughs> tú, Eres tú. Tú que me ves Eres con dos tú. ojos. <laughs> sí, 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 ahorita me vio y siguió haciéndose como que nada. Pero no. <laughs> Rafa, ayúdanos ahí. Quiere, quiere, quiere que le cante la canción I'm begging, <laughs> begging you. <laughs> okay. Your corner, Rafa. Uh, go, Rafa. Okay. Hey. Hello, Rafa. How are you? I'm nice fine. You. Thank you. And you? Very well. Uh, I know that uh, you are working in... A company. What? Sorry. What kind of company do you work, Rafa? Repeat, please. What? What kind of company do you work? What they do? In my company, more or less, I product ten product in the um, the medicine and care. Ah. So, uh, do you know how, what kind of raw material they buy? In the for the um, only five products in the market. And um, do you know uh, how many products uh, does your workplace buy? I think uh, 25 dollars. Uh, they spend, they spend only that that can, quantity of money. Twenty five, twenty five dollars. Dollars. Yes. It's a little bit. I Jeez. think, I think is is was more. Okay, and um, in my company, uh, they they are. They buy uh, many raw material every day. They buy wood. They buy, I don't know, no sé cómo se dice tela, clothes, clothes. You can say clothes or, or, or fabrics. Fabrics. Mm -hmm. Okay. And they are, they buy uh, many uh, nails and like paint for paint the furnitures 
um, glass for the, or I don't know if I uh, crystal or or glass. Yes. Glass. For the glass. I, glass. I would say glass. Yes. Okay. Um, I think that they spend around maybe sometimes is different, but sometimes if they buy, they spend around eight thousand dollars, maybe one day, maybe, and for raw material. So only that. Hey, Rafa. Thanks, Rafa. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs> good, 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 good guys. That was really good. So um, nice. I can see you work for a big company, Linda. Okay, because raw material is, you know, I mean, I mean, you guys get a lot of raw material, which is, uh, I mean, you said thousands in a day. So I imagine it's a big company. And then Rafa is a very small company, $25, you, you know, <laughs> that's very like small company. Okay, so uh, volunteers, one more, volunteers, volunteers. I wanted to say guys, yo escuché varias veces, eh, de hecho se me olvidó mencionar, ¿no? Previously con uh, el, el primer grupo. Acuérdense que después de for decimos ing, porque escuché alguna vez que hicieron for y luego dijeron el verbo en, en presente. That's not possible. We say for and then the verbo ing. Remember that. Cortémonos de eso. Um, so, next ones. Volunteers. ¿Qué más quiere tratar? Who else wants to try? One more. Only one. Thank you, Marlene. Choose your um, Marlene and Idali. With her. Okay. Hello, Dalia. Hi, Marlene. How are you? I'm fine. You? Good. Um, what's the name of the company do you work for? And my company is a. Uh... Uh, Swarovski. And what they sold? It's a, it's a jewelry. Excuse me? It's a jewelry. Uh, okay. Um, how many products uh, do you think that they uh, buy? Um, I think it's um, in in is the my work is um, for example necklace earring is um maybe two two thousand in. Buy. They buy two thousand. Yes. Okay. And how do you um? And what do you think they spent for to buy that? It's so much money because it's a it's a expense expensive, and I think uh, it's them spend um uh, approximately um. Uh, Twenty, twenty thousand dollars, or or more, maybe per month or per day. Excuse me. Per month or per it, month. It's, it's um. It depend the the temporality. The see it is a uh, for example and in, in December. Uh, they they spend our around the uh, one hundred thousand dollars, oh, more or less. They spend a lot. Yeah. Yes, because because it's a, a crystal and 
uh -huh. a crystal in the in the jewelry is a very expensive one for for that. Yeah. Thanks for the information. Okay, you're welcome. <laughs> Okay, so thank you so much, uh, girls, for sharing about your uh, billion or millionaire companies. Okay, so I know the yearly because of, of what they sell, it's it might be a little bit expensive, right? But thank you so much, Idalia and Marlene, for sharing about that. We are going to move on, guys. Uh, we still have some time, and we need to focus on a topic today, which is a topic that you might have previously studied, but then it's okay to reinforce. I want to know, guys, to move on. What do you know about countable and uncountable nouns? Can you guys give me examples of countable nouns right now? Maybe on the chat or maybe open your mind and give me some countable nouns. Let's make a list. Countable nouns, what comes to your mind? What do you see in your house? Objects, what do you see in your house? Countable you... uh, uh, shoes, books. Books, okay. What else do you see in your house that you can count? Objects, windows, chairs, chairs. Okay, okay. Objects that so you can mm -hmm. count. I'm gonna give you. Listen to this, please. Listen to this. Please turn on your camera. I wanna see everybody's camera on. Raquel, you did. I don't see you. Hello, Raquel. I wanna see everybody. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Look around your house. Okay. What can you see around? What do you see around where you are? What do you see? I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you, listen to this. I'm gonna give you three minutes. No, I think it's too much. I'm gonna give you two minutes for you to go around your house and choose three objects, okay? So go ahead, two minutes, go ahead. Three objects, go. You can stand up, go ahead and choose three objects. Leave the camera on. Go ahead and choose three objects. Choose them, pick them up, get them for you. Collect three objects. The door. No, go and get it. Get it. Something that you can, something that you can get. Go, stand up, go look for something. Choose three objects. Three Ooh. objects. Okay. The door. But choose them. Like, like my case, I got my phone here. I got this speaker. I don't know. I mean, go ahead and choose them. What can you see? Like, I got, I got a fan here. My watch is right here. So choose three objects. Look at what I got here. I got, uh, I got uh, my watch. I got this speaker. I got my phone. So choose three objects and have them with you. Okay. Uh, okay. JC has three. Marlene, how many do you have? Three objects. Yep. See, Linda has, okay. Three. Three, good. Stand up, please. Go look for something around. Uh, I said objects. Don't get your husband or wife, One, please. Two, three. <laughs> <laughs> I said object and then you go and look for your, your husband. Don't do that. Don't be mean. Okay. Uh, so three objects. Ready, Raquel? We're going to wait for Judy. She's coming back. Three objects. I can see. I got my three. Oh my God, my objects. Okay. Harrison has them ready. Maria Julia. I can see. Narciso, you have your three objects. <laughs> nice. Okay. Yes, I see that Idalia has her objects. Linda, do you have yours? Thank yes. you, Narciso. Narciso has a, has a painting. <laughs> okay, <laughs> nice. Okay, Judy, what is it? Ah, your vitamins. <laughs> okay, so can you count then? Yes, can you count? Can you count then? Yes, one, two, three. One, so... Two, three. Yeah, if you count, then these are countables, right? Countable nouns. Marlene, what is it? Is it a brush? Is it a brush? Okay. 
Yes. So this is what we're going to do now. Listen to what we're going to do. Don't put them away. No los va a guardar todavía. Don't put them away. I'm going to make uh, small groups and then you're going to um, give away these objects to your peers. Okay. Do you understand that? You're going to give it away. Se lo van a regalar virtually. Okay. So for example, but then you're going to say why you give it away. For example, okay, um, I'm going to give this away. You choose only one. Uh, let's see, I'm going to give it to Harrison. Harrison, I'm going to give you my um, speaker, okay? Uh, I love it, but I want to give it I to you because uh, you're going to, uh, whenever you are working, you can listen to music, you know? And you can take it to the shower because, you know, <laughs> it's resistance, water resistant. You can be listening to music while you are taking a shower. So it's cool. So I give it, I give it to you. Okay. I want. All right. Great. So that's what that's what you're gonna do. Now I'm gonna make groups and then you're gonna give it away. But by say why? Why is it important? Why you give it? So speak. Speak in groups. That's that's what you're gonna do. Is it clear? Yes. But say why you give it. Y si lo ven algún día en físico, le dicen. No, but it's just practicing, okay? Just practicing. Okay. So, so here we go. Please speak as much as you can. Explain why you give it to your classmate. I'm going to make only three groups this time. So you, so we have more people in, in each group. So let's see. Here we go. Take turns. Tomen turnos. Here we go. For example, um, I, let me see. I'm going to give you this cup. It's ready and it's perfect for the coffee. Uh, for example, what is it? Give away. I'm gonna give you. I'm, I'm gonna away. give you. You can say I'm gonna give you this away or only give. Como solo decir give, ya se entiende que es un regalo. Give. I'm gonna give you this. Uh, all right. Good. I wanna give you uh this bottle of water. Uh, fast, no, no, fast is fat. You have uh, exercise. 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 <laughs> exercise. Okay. Exercise. Oh. Only that. <laughs> What's next? Linda? Okay. I'm going to give you a condo, <laughs> but for when the light is no sé cómo se dice when the light is, is gone. gone. <laughs> Cuando mm -hmm. se vaya la luz. Mm -hmm. When the light is uh -huh. gone. When the light is gone, you you have this. Ice competition <laughs> part for not in the dark. It's competition. Who's gonna, who's, right now. who's gonna give? <laughs> I give my pens. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, mouse. And mirror. Okay, mirror. Okay. <laughs> Do you like it? <laughs> yes. 
Thank you, Reina Ray. <laughs> I have a I have a, a, a shoes. A shoes. Uh, a small shoes. Who's Here, gonna shoes. Who's gonna want? Who's gonna want? <laughs> <laughs> this is from for from my son. <laughs> so everybody received a gift. Yes, teacher. Okay. Did you say why you give it away? Mm, yes, I I. I give the bottle the the of water to Maria Igalia. And, okay. <laughs> okay. The, the water is on a half that, that she can open the bottle and refill of water. <laughs> refill it, okay. okay. From the chorro. <laughs> from the chorro, water chorro. <laughs> okay, good. So we can we can return. Thank you so much. I'll be I'll see you guys in a minute. I uh, really hope everyone got something. <laughs> did you get something or did you get anything, Norman? Le regalaron algo? Yes? Yes. Okay. I uh, really... A cup of coffee. A cup of coffee. Nice. Yes. And did you like it? Yes, so much. Okay. Uh, do you drink coffee? Yes, a four cup of coffee all day. Four per day. Well, that's a lot. Do you have any specific one? I love Cafe Listo. <laughs> no, I drink uh, Starbucks. Cafe Rico. Cafe Rico. <laughs> Marlene only Starbucks. <laughs> and then, uh, okay. Of course. <laughs> of course, my horse. <laughs> look at the chair. Uh, look, look oh, me. look at that, Daniel. Wow. <laughs> now, that's cool. Oh, you have all oh, there. You're ready, you know. In my, this is in my office. <laughs> nice. That's really cool. So you have a lot of cafe listos, right? <laughs> cafe rico. No, rico. <laughs> I, I'm sorry for my, my ghetto, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay so thank you so much guys i really like you know the when you guys share uh i don't know if anybody would like to share about what he or she got norma already said she got a cup of coffee like a mug you know to drink her coffee who wants to share what did you get did you like it is it meaningful? Significa algo para usted? Porque yo vi, I saw Daniel giving away a bottle of water and a pair of zapatos. I don't know. Pair of shoes. <laughs> <You know? laughs> but he said, he said, this is from my song. So it's important for me. You know, so keep it. You see, that's really meaningful. So who wants to share? One or two volunteers to share the experience? Or you didn't like what you were giving? No le gusta lo que le dieron. Hmm? Ah, María y dale, go ahead. <laughs> oh, I think that um, Daniel uh, gave me uh, something that is necessary. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm going to uh, take it with me when uh, I, uh, I go to the mountain or when I walk... Um, go out to walk and that is a uh, uh, bottle of water <laughs> <laughs> okay and it's but not, it's not and, it, and it's not full <laughs> in in my group is yeah. only only pencil only oh. pen <laughs> only pencil <laughs> yeah it's very oh. sad 
only pens. <laughs> okay, no, they. I give you my heart, Marlene. When it when it's to hear somebody saying I give you my heart, but that's not that's not possible, Marlene. <laughs> okay, so thank you so much. Uh huh. Who Marlene else? Is <laughs> All right. Anybody else? Oh, okay, so we're gonna read. We're gonna study, guys, about um this topic which is countable and uncountable nouns and i know you guys might have uh, studied this previously but like i said at the beginning we can still go over this now we have how much and how many how much is for uncountable which means we cannot say one two three because it's something that we can count how much is, goes for uncountable nouns for example what comes to your mind for uncountable nouns what do you see in your room that is that you that you can't count can we count water the light oh okay no energy. energy energy maybe we can measure right the, the energy within units okay what else can can't we count oil oil yes we cannot do that what else rice, rice. yeah we, uh, we can okay water. water butter like the song of bts butter have you heard of that song no no you don't like bts it's still it's for teenagers right oh, yes. th there's a song uh, uh, which uh, name is nice. butter butter we can account butter so we have these two here we have how much and then we have how many how much does the refrigerator weights weights listen to that weights okay how much does it cost how much is the warranty and how much does it storage and then we have on the other side, we have how many. Now we can count. How many features does it have? How many colors? How many functions does it have? And how many products that do you want? In this case, yeah, as you can see, we have letter S, features, colors, functions, okay. and products. If we can pluralize, si lo podemos pluralize, si lo hacemos plurales, pluralize, we can say this is countable, we can count. But if we cannot make them plural, then is uncountable, okay? So based on this information, I want to give you, well, it's almost time. So maybe tomorrow we can start uh, checking, but I'm gonna give you two minutes for you to give it a shot, like try to answer these um, what these questions right here we have. Maybe we can do one or two because of time. Guys, what do we use here? Number one, how much or how many? How many? How, how many? many? Why how many do you, why do you, mm -hmm. Because we talk about the piece. Pieces, right? And the pieces is plural, exactly. We say how many. I like how it. How, how can you read the entire question, please, Daniel? How many pieces do I need to assemble this? Nice. How many, how many pieces do I need to assemble this? Nice. If you are in a factory, you can say that. And what about on number two? What do we say? That's interesting. Two teaspoons. How many are the cost? How much? How much? Why do we say how much and not how many? How much do these books cost? Because it's we're gonna use how much because we talk about money. Money. Exactly, exactly, because we talk about the cost, that's money. Money itself, money, like the, the word money, we can account, we can count bills and coins, but money itself, uncountable. That's a good one. So we say how much, good. So guys, go ahead and complete from three, four, five, and six. Uh, we have two more minutes, maybe we can finish it. Go ahead, please. Two minutes. Decide which one. Five. Oh, 
Please compare it. Please don't compare. How much? How much? How much? Four. Hours do I charge it? Quanta horas? Um, how many? How much? How many? How many? How many? Finish there. Thank you so much. Let's take uh, last minute and then we share. How much money do I? Okay, because of time, we are going to share the answers. Okay, did you finish? Yes or not? Let's see, uh, we're going to read all of them. Yes, all of them. Uh, Daniel, read number one again, please. How many things do I need? This is, do I need to assemble this? Thank you. Idalia, number two. Uh, how much do these books cost? Thank you. Number three, Raquel. Uh, teacher, no, no veo el manual. No tengo el manual. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. So you need to get it for tomorrow, okay? No problem. Norma, number three. How many is the battery life of this computer? Mm, mm. How many the life? How much? Uh, how much? How exactly, much? it refers to time, right? So in that case, it's how much. Let's continue. Number four. Let's see, Narciso. Narciso, number four. Okay. How many hours do I charge it? Good. Number five, uh, Christina. Um, how much money do you have? Thank you. Numbers. And the last one, uh, Marlene, help us, please. Is how, how much? How much gallons of water does this need? Are you sure? Um, how? How many? How many I'm gallons? Sorry. Because gallons, you can count the gallons. I sent yes. I sent you the answers already on the chat, so you can double check. Mm -hmm. Let me go ahead and check the attendance because it's almost time. We only have one minute left, according to my watch. My, so let's see number one on the list. Narciso. Present teacher. Yes. yes. Thank you so much. Good night. We can say good night now, right? Oh, no, good Narciso night. is my first <laughs> session. Teacher, okay. teacher, teacher. Yes. Eh, Podría dejar 10 minutos para cuando lo necesite más adelante. Uh, if you have an emergency, it's okay. Maybe somebody else can get it. Alguien más lo puede tener ahorita. Si tiene una emergencia, no hay problema. Uh, okay. Uh, Cristina. Present teacher. Uh, thank you. Daniel. Present teacher. Elsie. Present. Thank you, Gabriela. Herson. Present teacher. Thank you, Jose Miguel. Jose Rubén. Uh, JC. Present teacher. Linda. Present teacher. Maria Idalia. Maria, Maria, Maria Julia. Marlene. Present. Marvin. Present. Norma. Present. Ra Thank you, Rafa. 
Present teacher. Raquel. Reinaldo. Present teacher. Xiomara. Present. Thank you so much for Present confirming. Teacher. Thank you so much, Raquel. I listen to you. So, guys, thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. Uh, have a nice night. You can say good night now and try to do the homework and see you tomorrow. Okay? Tomorrow is Friday. Bye. -bye. <laughs> try to rest. Yay. Good night, everyone. Bye, take care. Hey. Bye, everyone. Good night. Hello, Elsie. Hola. ¿No tienes sueño? No, todavía no. Este, no sé si tiene tiempo, ya que Narciso se fue. Yo sé que tiene, quizás tiene que trabajar mañana. No sé cómo está su, su horario. No, no, sí, está bien. Eh, eh, bueno, yo la verdad que no le entendí tanto porque como le dije, o sea, usted está hablando por, eh, en inglés totalmente y entiendo porque obviamente está en el, en el básico 4. Entonces, eh, todos los demás también y yo no porque a mí, como le dije, me pasaron de, de prácticamente lo primero hasta el 4 porque en teoría ya no había cupo. Entonces, para que no me dejaran afuera, eh, yo acepté. Pero... Mm, Vaya, mire, no sé. si en primer lugar no quiero que se sienta en, así como en desventaja, porque todos los compañeros que usted ve, eh, se, la verdad todos son bien tranquilos. Yo lo, el, la mayoría uh -huh. los, los he conocido porque los he tenido casi en el grupo en uno, dos y tres, algunos uh -huh. de ellos. Entonces, y he visto cómo han venido mejorando, la verdad es bien increíble. Entonces, así que lo que usted observa ahorita ha sido como esfuerzo de ellos y no, no se vaya a desesperar porque ah, no entiendo, ya no, ¿verdad? Es más, tómelo como un reto. Un reto de hecho, yo... hasta Yuri, Yuri también está en este grupo y ella estaba conmigo en el anterior. Uh -huh. Entonces, eh, hasta ella me estaba escribiendo diciéndome que estaba perdida porque no, no entendía nada. Uh -huh. Entonces, eso. Vaya, entonces, este, yo me puedo comprometer a ayudarles. Ahí escríbanme al WhatsApp, al grupo, este, uh -huh. alguna pregunta que tengan este, para que de esta manera podamos ir aclarando y ayudándole. Porque entiendo, uh -huh. entiendo de que esos dos meses hacen una diferencia. Sin embargo, uh -huh. este, los temas no están muy complicados. Ahora, por ejemplo, usar el how much el, en el how many es el tema principal. Uh -huh. Entonces, así que puede usted investigar ahí cómo usamos how much. En lo de how much y how many no es tanto. Porque, o sea, sí sé que eso es con contables y no contables, algo así. O, o para qué se usa exactamente, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Entonces, eso no es tanto, pero ajá. Pero voy a, a tratar de... Uh -huh. Pero lo que, lo que usted uh -huh. vio, lo demás era porque eran actividades que no, no directamente el manual. Era para conocerse, uh -huh. para salir un poquito de, de, lo, de la rutina. ¿va? Y lo otro que le, me gusta hacerlo también, que lo hagan más de manera natural. Por ejemplo, de las preguntas que traten de agregar más ellos, ¿verdad? Ese es el uh -huh. reto, pero el reto lo voy poniendo yo porque veo que se van los chicos también adaptando. Pero en sí el manual, es, el manual o se le, se le va a evaluar a usted con base a lo del manual. Así que ahí tiene exactamente. Okay. Yo, si usted ve que los reto un poco es porque veo que ellos a veces se, se lanzan. Y ya los he notado que a veces se lanzan. Por ejemplo, ahora improvisen. Les dije, algunos están improvisando. Esa es la parte del reto que les pongo. Pero en sí no nos vamos a salir del tema. Entonces uh -huh. cualquier pregunta que tenga es muy bienvenida. Dígale a su amiga o su compañera también de que se sienten confianza de preguntar. Quieren hablar en español. Háganlo ustedes dos. Les voy a permitir que lo hagan. Los demás no. Pero ustedes sí uh -huh. lo pueden hacer. Y levanten la mano. Mire, eh, explíqueme. ¿Verdad? Eso sería lo más oportuno. ¿Sí? De acuerdo. Gracias. Vaya, pues entonces. Pues, uh -huh. Ahí estamos para servirle. Cuídense muchísimo. Gracias, igual. Feliz noche. Feliz noche.